welcome to this week's Wicked Wild Barbecue. Today I'm going to make a barbecue pork cooked inside a bamboo tube. Yeah? Now for this beautiful dish, the ingredients you will need for your shopping list is as follows. Pork minced and pork loin. Pork fat or kidney fat, I'm using kidney fat. Thai fish sauce, shallots, dry red chilies, lemongrass, lime leaves, fresh turmeric, ginger, lemon salt or regular salt, bell pepper, spring onions, sun-dried tomatoes, roasted peanuts, pine nuts. I'm using also noni leaves. These noni leaves grow in the back here. Uh, locally they call it noni. It's, uh, I think it's from the prickly pear. And uh, in Thailand, the small leaves, they wrap them with minced pork and roasted uh, coconut and things like that and they, they cook it and they eat the leaves. So I'm going to use, this is a mi mix and match of, of my experiences on my travels. So I'm using a, an authentic Thai sausage recipe and I'm mixing it with wrapping leaves. This is something we do in Europe. I just saw them over there and I thought, well, why not? I'm going to use it, right? Now, obviously at home, you might not find in England or parts of the states you would but definitely not in the UK uh, or Europe you won't find bamboo right so you can use aluminium foil or you can use uh, wax paper that's also fantastic right too much talking the sausage mix okay so I'm going to make the minced sausage first so sausage meat now I'm using this very very spicy Thai spice mix which I made and the ingredients are going to come up on your screen right now, right here on my shoulder. And this is very strong, sour, spicy. Yeah, it's got a lot of kick. Let's have a look at that. Look at the colors. Rather spicy that one is. Right, um, spring onions and lime leaves. You can buy. Sorry, spring onions. That's so spicy, my brain's not working. Lemongrass. <clears throat> Gosh. You can buy dried lemongrass in, in any supermarket. Oh, and I think even parts of Chinatown and places you can actually get that now. So, I've got yellow fingers. Yes, turmeric and ginger. That's why I've got yellow fingers. No, it's not from smoking. Right. Shallots. Fat. It's important to have the fat in there because if you don't, it's going to be dry. The fat gives it a nice moisture to your dish. Thai fish sauce. Now the Thai fish sauce is the Asian salt, or uh, equivalent, their equivalent to our salt. So Thai fish sauce, Thailand, Cambodia, Laos, Vietnam is fish sauce. China, Hong Kong, Singapore, Japan, Indonesia, they use the light soy sauce, sweet soy sauce for their dishes, but it is nonetheless the salt. So what I'm going to do with this dish is actually mix it up and just cook it a little bit to taste it because you need to know if the salt element for you is at the right temperature, right? Now, I'm going to mix all that in a minute. Just look at that. It's a nice bundle of colors here. Red chilies. Now, these are dry red chilies that I've soaked overnight in warm water. So they're really rehydrated, right? And the reason I'm using the dry ones, which they do in Asia, is because you get that nice, intense flavor. Because once it's been dried, the flavor intensifies. So I'm not going to put too much in there because I've already blown my head off with that spice mix. And I don't want to make it too crazy. Okay, so mixing this up. So we're making a nice little paste like that and make sure you get off all those extra pieces like so. So what I'm going to do is pinch a little bit off and put it on the barbie just to see if the soya sauce, sorry, the uh, fish sauce um, is the right amount for my salt okay that paste is beautiful isn't it look at that so i've been roasting this on my yeah let's have a look
rather pleased with that one. Okay. Time to roll out the sausage. So, having buggered it up a few times because my bamboo is just too thin, right? Trying one more time and I'm seriously hoping that this time, right, to get a better piece of uh, wax paper because my wax paper's knackered. Right? One sec. So I've embarked on the help of a fellow chef friend, Simon, from the UK. He's out here also in the Caribbean doing a bit of cooking. Right, and uh, he's going to help me make sure this gets inside the bamboo. Right, let's see. Yeah, that's good. So what I'm going to do is do it uh, in two wax. Right, one piece, roll it over like so, so I can really, I think doing two pieces it's going to make it a lot easier to slide into the bamboo tubes. There you go. Yeah. Should have done that the first time round. Stupid Sherlock! Simple Sherlock! Chef stuff made extremely complicated because we are too lazy ass to climb our fat lardy ass down a mountain slope and get a fatter piece of bamboo. Anyway, right, this one is pork sausage made inside a bamboo shoot. Take 522. There you go. Pop it in there like that. And if it doesn't go in, it's going in. force it. <laughs> yeah. I should have lubricated it in the first point. Uh, point. Right. It always helps to have a bit of lubrication. Right. We all know that as fellows, isn't it? Right? See? Lubrication. <laughs> <laughs> nice and easy. Straight in. <laughs> Perhaps not. <sighs> right. Pushing it in, and whatever bit comes out at the end it's is like going that. in my noni leaves. I have some pork left over. So. I'm going to make pork inside my noni leaves, right? That should do it. The we'll white that on the barbie now. So I'm leaving that on the barbecue now until the bamboo is black on all sides. From my experience, rule of thumb cooking with bamboo, if you use green bamboo, which you should, and your bamboo is burnt on all sides, your meat or your fish is theoretically cooked and it hasn't proven me wrong up to now don't use dry bamboo otherwise it'll just burn and your food won't be cooked right non your leaves just a little roll like that and just they look a little bit like uh, what you call those uh, dolmada dolmada thank you chef dolmadas yeah <laughs> Dalmadas, Thai Dalmadas, huh? It's Italian, but never mind. My Italian buddies will be cursing me for that. Right. Yeah. I love these noni leaves, and uh, this is something that I picked up when I was in Thailand too. Uh, they had all different types of meetings, so it's quite, quite a uh, coincidental and. Uh, Actually, really good that um, not all of it fits in the bamboo, so I can use the noni leaves and I get two dishes in one pot, right? What's that? Yep, done. I'll go and check my bamboo. I'm roasting my noni leaves on top of my bamboo. Yeah. And I deliberately place this one on the coals before so I can actually cook on top of the um, charred wood. Yeah. Right. There she 
take about uh, 10 minutes and hopefully they won't burn. Anyway, if they do burn on the outside, the pork will still be great on the middle and then have a nice little bit of charcoal flavor. So I've acquired my buddy from Island Boogies while, I'm, while I've been cooking. He could smell my, my Thai pork sausage off in the background. So he's gonna come and tell you about his business. So when you come to St. Lucia and you have a look at these over here, you have gotta try this, it's great, great fun. I'm gonna go and get my sausage in the noni leaves and in the bamboo while he checks you out. All right, all right, all right, all right. Well, hello, yeah, I'm William with Island Boogies St. Lucia. Just here trying out this, um, um, what sauce is it again, Sweet chef? Chili. Sweet chili sauce, yeah man, looks very good. I'm gonna try it now. Mmm, delicious, yeah man, very good. Okay, so yeah, Island Buggies, we're in here in St. Lucia. We do a number of tours, you know, so when you come out here and you come and try the chef's food, come and check out Island Buggies and you can drive around and have a good time. Chef, how are we going there with the sausages? We're very good. All right, yeah, good vibes. Yeah, looks great. Ooh. So, bamboo delicious. as well, one second. <laughs> that was a little scary. <laughs> oh my! He, he, now he's pulled out his big bamboo. Sounds like In a the Caribbean, song, you know right? what that means. Da, 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 da. Right, okay. <laughs> right. Now I'm gonna leave that for a second while I make my little salad. Okay. So sun-dried tomatoes. <laughs> big bamboo sounds like a soca. Shallots, bell peppers, okay. spring onions, some chopped shallots, and my sweet chili sauce. If you check out my video the, uh, after you've clicked subscribe, by the way, um, there'll be a little video to click on if you want the recipe of my Thai sweet chili sauce. And uh, I'm making sure that you hear that now because my father so kind enough to poke me in the eye and says Ian you didn't give me the bloody recipe so there you go dad sweet chili sauce one more time it is on the end of the video bless him he's 80 years old and he's, he's, get, he's getting on yeah he's getting on he's still a young man well his brain thinks he is right there you go right. Right. so the salad is there done gonna have a little taste Sweet, spicy, zesty, wonderful. <laughs> we put that on the side while well, we check this bamboo out. Now I'm going to crack this. I don't normally do this, it normally slips out. But you know, as I mentioned earlier, I'm not exactly Tarzan and uh, trying to get these bamboo in the middle of the island it's a bit of a pain the big bamboo is anyway because it's right off the slops and uh, I'm not sure they would take my weight you know what I mean? <laughs> never trust this to me there right. <laughs> oh. got it, thank you always good to have a bit of help now that still not coming Yes, it is rather warm. All right, look at that. Wow, wow. Wow. Oh, very nice. Yay! Yeah. They're, clap They're clapping. I've got to see if it's cooked yet. <laughs> right. I know feeling the texture. I know feeling the texture that uh, it is cooked. Yes, ladies, it feels like a willy. <laughs> Sorry about that one. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm gonna put a censorship right across my chef <laughs> chef nose. Sorry, I do keep it clean as much as possible, but from time to time, one is tempted. My pooch, she's my security. It's a she. she is. She is. 
she's a rescue dog. She couldn't walk when I first got her. Oh. A broken back leg and uh, no hair and she was about that big. Oh, uh, rescue, yeah. And now she's my best friend. She follows me everywhere. I bet. Oh yeah, you brought yeah. her back to life. <laughs> really cool. You know? Wow. Whoa. It looks delicious. Gingery. Salad. Gingery. Zesty, fragrant, a little bit spicy. Right. Look at that. Isn't that great? Yeah? A little bit of um, Thai salad on top. And this isn't a traditional Thai salad. This is a uh, Sherlock improvised Thai flavors. I mean, the, the sausage is an authentic recipe, right? But the salad is an authentic dressing, but um, done with kind of whatever I had in the cupboard, actually, right? Sausages inside. And not only leaves, and not only leaves, you can eat. Very, very tasty. It's like a salivating here. Ooh, let them come and have a taste. Rather pleased with that one. <laughs> Come on, dig in. <laughs> I'm rather pleased with that one. <laughs> one sec. Wow, that is not bad. Look at that. Look at that, people. Come and have a taste. Come on over. Right, just help yourself. Don't be shy. You can use my knife to cut if yeah, you want. Shy, <laughs> <laughs> when he heard food, <laughs> and she was like, "Yeah, that's me." There you go. So um, dip in the salad in the sauce. Shake only. Right. It's always good. It's always okay. good to have um, extra tasters so you can see naturally how. Mm. They might say it's nice here, but after when I'm editing, oh I can see the uh, their face. You know. Yeah, good. Wow. Wendy, wait. I'm gonna take a few more. Okay. Ready? Got it. When I really like something, I suck my knees. I'm not touching this. <laughs> with this hammer, that thing is awesome. Oh, the bamboo. Very good. Oh, the bamboo. Very, very good. Okay, so you need... Yeah. Are you going to do a bamboo roll then? Oh, that's perfect. Uh, okay. I see you. I can freeze a ginger. Enjoy garlic too much. Go next to the chef. Chef Sherlock. Thank you. Got to get in a big. Ginger, garlic, turmeric. Um, oh, got it. Thai fish sauce, very yeah. fresh. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, coriander, yeah. cinnamon, cloves. Mm -hmm. mm. Video. Wow, this was delicious. Thank, Thank you, Scott. You're welcome. So that yeah. the sausage mm -hmm. that you had in the bamboo is the same as the one yes. in the leaves. Yes. Yeah. Your turn. Normally, I get a really fat bamboo, but right. uh, when I went out to get hey, some, hey. I had to go in the rainforest. <laughs> yeah. Get it? Um, you mind if I grab a little more? Or? No, help yourself. Mm. Seriously, you. help yourself. William's nicer. Hmm. Delicious. Yeah, that is Jesus crazy Christ. good. <laughs> so, check out my social media, uh, Facebook, Twitter, awesome. everything. And don't forget to check us out every Friday, 4 o'clock right. GMT, that's English London time. Imagine Wicked that. Wild Barbecue. And please subscribe by clicking over here on my shoulder. Thanks for watching and bon appetit. Woo! Yeah, boys. Chef yeah. Yeah. Bon appetit. Wow. Wow. Are you on camera? Don't be nervous.